By your radiance, grant me the strength to continue to endure these dark days. To lay bare the path to salvation for my wayward brothers and sisters. So we may walk it together and to strike down all those who would see our will defied. Even as our suffering continued, I honored my pledge of patience to the Exactor. And yet you now appear before me, a stranger, bearing what was not yours to receive. A betrayal made flesh, and one I cannot brook. It always comes down to this.
Welcome, Dark Crusader. I had no doubt in my assessment of you, as one worthy of the monumental task which lies before us, Crusader. My name is Dunmire, and I am an exactor of the Dark Crusaders, the holy order of which you are now an honored member. The Church of Orion Radiance has assigned to me the duty of purging Mornstead of its Rogar blight, and ensuring the ancient tyrant Adir there was no liberation from his enduring imprisonment. By Aureus's divine will, I live again. It's a miracle. And to think I raised my sword to you, when all alone you were a divine instrument sent by him to deliver my death and rebirth and bring clarity. Forgive me, Lampair. I'm Pieta, of the Hallowed Sentinels, and as Aureus sustains me, so too will I sustain you. Whether by making manifest your potential or through my healing blood, contained within the Sanguinarix you carry, should you find any saintly quintessences, bring them to me, and they can bolster the power of my blood further still. The beacons must be cleansed. The Hallowed Sentinels restored, and Adir's malignancy eradicated. Through whatever is to come, fellow chosen of Aureus, we stand together in service of him. Our holy work continues, Lampbearer. Fellow sanctified vessel, may Aureus' divine radiance flow through you and into you. So the Exactors found himself a new instrument. As Exactors are wont to do. And given that lamp was intended for me, should his paladin fall. And yet now here you are, Lamp Bearer. Well, it seems I was right to doubt the value of a Dark Crusader's work. That's 
it, isn't it? Oh, the lamp of immortality. And the genuine article. Not a useless empty vessel like the one I saw that witless fool bumbling around with. I've learned a little since coming to Mornstead about that lamp and the awful mission to which it's attached. I hope you recognize that frightful burden for what it is. In truth, what's been done to you is downright cruel. Careful, if you're headed for Pilgrim's Perch, friend. Uh, the hallowed sentinels don't welcome everyone. Not even a faithful pilgrim who's crossed countless miles of land and sea to join them. All I wanted was to serve the divine judge cleric, but they deemed me unworthy and chased me off. What's a poor, rejected disciple to do now, I ask you? Ah! <laughs> 